Good day, everyone. My name is Pastor Ekechi Wichinedum, and I'm your host at Everyday Prayer Guide Television. Today, we shall be looking at another warfare prayer, which is titled, O Earth, Vomit All My Hanging Blessings. O Earth, Vomit All My Hanging Blessings. Now, a lot of Christians don't know that they can command the earth to favor them. Just like you can come to a new city and you speak to the city. You can come to the United States and you can say, United States, hear the word of the Lord. You must favor me. United States, hear the word of the Lord. All my blessings, I receive them in the name of Jesus. Anything that has a name answers to the word of the Lord. The Bible said the name of the Lord is above all things on earth, under the earth. And the name of the Lord dominates every name. His name is lifted above every name. When the name of Jesus is mentioned, everything that has a name hears and obeys. And listen to me, that includes the earth. The Bible said the earth is the Lord's and his fullness thereof. And if you read Jeremiah 22, 29 to 30, you see when the prophet was commanding the earth, he said, O oh, earth, earth, hear the word of the Lord. The earth hears. When you speak to the earth, the earth begins to favor you. When you speak to the earth, everything you say to the earth, the earth begins to respond to you. Jesus spoke to the wind. The wind responded. Jesus, the, the Bible said, uh, Jesus, God spoke to the waters. The waters parted. Now listen to me. Everything that has a name responds to the name of Jesus. So we're going to be commanding the earth. Many of you are struggling on earth, disappointment on earth, backwardness on the earth, things are not working for you on earth. Listen to me, you're going to command the earth to begin to favor you right now. You're going to command the earth to begin to favor you. Many of you, you walk like elephants, but you feel like ants. You struggle and you labor, nothing is working out. We are going to be praying. Listen to me, as you speak to the earth, the earth will begin to favor you. On this earth, God will bless you. On this earth, things will work for you. On this earth, doors will open for you. On this earth, you will get that visa. On this earth, you will celebrate your miracle children. On this earth, things that used to be hard for you before, they will begin to turn around for you, for your good. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Are you set to command the earth? Now, remember, we are praying this prayer with the earth. You need sun because this is a day a point of contact to the earth. You see, this is sand I'm holding right now. We are going to be commanding it. Now, as we're about to pray, we're going to put it on the floor and we're going to be commanding it. After we finish praying, I will tell you what to do with it. Some of you who are not new to this channel, you already know what to do. But for those of, those of us that are joining you, after the prayers, I'm going to give you the instruction on what to do with this sand. Praise the Lord. Now, listen to me. Anything you say to the earth, you will see in the earth. Anything you say to the earth, you will see in the earth. Now, place it on the floor. I repeat, anything you say to the earth, you will see in the earth. Anything you command this earth to do, your eyes will see it manifest on this earth in the name of Jesus. If you believe, I want you to join me to pray these prayers right now. Hallelujah. I want you to pray this prayer with me. Say with me. Say, Father, I thank you for you are the God of heaven and earth. Now lift up your voice and pray that prayer right now. Father, I thank you. Jesus, I thank you for you are the God of heaven and earth. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, pray that prayer with all your heart. Is the Lord God of the heavens and the earth. Father, I thank you for you are the God of heaven and earth. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, I give you praise. Jesus, I adore you. Ancient of days, I magnify you. For you are the God of heaven and earth. In the mighty name of Jesus, I appreciate the Lord. Appreciate the law. Zemarata namako soto robo sinde lebregede. Mariba baba karaba shanda. Father, I thank you for you are the God of the heavens and of the earth. In the mighty name of Jesus, for you are the God of the heavens and of the earth. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, I thank you. Jesus, I adore you for you are the God of the heavens and of the earth. In the mighty name of Jesus, make sure you are thanking the Lord. Make sure you are thanking Him. He is the God of the heavens and the earth. He is the God of the 
the sea, the God of the air, is the God of all things. Father, I thank you for you are the God of the heavens and of the earth in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Now, we are going to begin to command the earth. <laughs> Whatsoever you say to the earth, you will see it in the earth. In the mighty name of Jesus. Now, pray this next prayer with me. Say, O oh, earth, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to favor me now. You want to see favor on earth? Begin to command the earth. O oh, earth, hear the word of the Lord. Hear the word of the Lord. Begin to favor me now. In the mighty name of Jesus. In my business. In my career. In my place of work. In my marriage. In my marital destiny. In my spiritual life. Oh, earth. Hear the word of the Lord. Begin to favor me now. Begin to favor me now. Begin to favor me now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, earth, hear the word of the Lord. Command the earth, command it right now. Begin to favor me. Enough of bad luck in my life. Enough of setback in my life. Enough of disappointment in my life. Enough of delays in my life. Enough of promise and failure in my life. Oh, earth, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to favor me now. 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 Pray that prayer with all your heart, child of God. Let Jesus hear your voice. Let the Lord hear your voice. Oh, it, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to favor me. Begin to favor me. Begin to favor me. Begin to favor me. Marabako Sotorobo Shandalagada. Begin to favor me now. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Next prayer. Say, oh, it, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to open doors for me. Begin to open doors. The Bible says, I'm the one, Jesus said in Revelation, He said, when I open a door, no man can shut. When I shut a door, no man can open. Now, pray that prayer. Say, oh, earth, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to open doors for me. Doors of favor. Doors of blessings. Doors of new opportunities. Doors of nations. Begin to open doors for me. Pray that prayer right now. Oh, earth. Open up your gates for me in the mighty name of Jesus. Pray that prayer right now. Pray that prayer now. Masoke paradisa mate nokoska lebranda mata yada da. Oh, ex, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to open doors to me. Doors of nations. Doors of blessings. Doors of breakthroughs. Doors of favor in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, ex. Hear the word of the Lord. Pray that prayer. Maseke le bashaka le brondo so prenita. Oh, Ed, hear the word of the Lord. 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 Begin to open doors for me in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Oh, my prayer family, do you want to grow spiritually? Do you want to learn how to have authority over witches and wizards? foundational powers, marine spirit husband and spirit wife? Do you want to learn the art of spiritual warfare that will help you chase that strange woman that has a hold over your marriage? If this and many more is what you desire to learn as a child of God, I welcome you to Everyday Prayer Guide School of Deliverance. Everyday Prayer Guide School of Deliverance is a militant practical school of deliverance where we teach you the art of spiritual warfare. In this school of deliverance, we're going to teach you how to handle witches, the kind of prayers to pray, the ordinances to use, and the practical spiritual exercises to do to destroy uh, witches and wither, to destroy foundational powers, to destroy spirit husband, spirit wife, to take charge of your dreams. We're going to teach you the prayers to pray. What else? If a strange woman is tormenting your marriage, we're going to show you how to handle them spiritually. When you handle them spiritually, you see the result in the physical. It's a practical school of deliverance. I encourage you to be part of it also if you want to see breakthrough in your business breakthrough in your career open doors we're going to teach you how to summon forces from heaven to command open doors 
in your life. I'm going to expose you to the art of warfare, prophetic prayers, powerful ordinances, and powerful spiritual steps to control your life. I encourage you to be part of this school of deliverance. It's a yearly program. Every year we keep updating it. We keep updating it with different courses and different prayers. Once you enroll, you can choose to enroll monthly or you can choose to enroll for the year. Praise the Lord. It's an ongoing school of deliverance where you keep building your spiritual arsenal. You keep building your spiritual life. I encourage you to enroll today. Enough of running from place to place. Enough of running away from the devil. Enough of being scared. We're going to teach you how to be a prayer giant. How to make changes in the physical through the spiritual realm i encourage you to be part of this school hallelujah the website is displayed on the screen epg.epgsod.com www.epgsod.com visit that website today enroll and become a prayer giant listen to me you shall be in command as you join the school of deliverance god bless you now let's get back to the prayers Next prayer. I want you to pray this prayer with your heart. Anything you command the earth, it you will see it in your life. A great man of God shared a testimony. He said in those days he will bring the globe, the globe that the map that, that carries the map of the world, and he will begin to speak to the globe. He will say, Hey, the nations of the world are open to me. Nations of the world, Asia is open to me. Uh, Australia is open to me. Africa is open to me. US, North America is open to me. South America is open to me. Europe is open to me. Antarctica is open. The guy began to call continent after continent and he began to command doors to be open. Today, that man is a global believer, man of God. He's a global pastor. There is no nation of the world that you don't see his ministry. There is no nation. He's established in every nation. The whole world has opened their doors to him. Why? Whatever you command on the earth, you will see in the earth. That's why the Bible said that anything you bind on earth is binding heaven. Anything you lose on the earth, you will see it. It is, it is authorized. Once you declare it on earth, heaven will, will approve it and you will see it. So I want you to pray this prayer with all your heart. Don't, don't play, pray it religiously. Pray these prayers, command the earth, and you will see the earth favor you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We are still praying. We are still praying. Now hear this. Pray this next prayer. Say, O oh, earth, hear the word of the Lord. Begin to trouble my destiny, help us till they favor me. In the book of Esther, the Bible said the king Ahasuerus could not sleep. He could not sleep. He woke up. He tried to sleep. He couldn't sleep until he favored Mordecai. Pray that prayer. Oh, earth, hear the word of the Lord. Give my destiny help us sleepless nights until they favor me. Pray that prayer in the name of Jesus. Those that are holding my blessings. Those that are that you are going to use to take me from one level to the other. Nobody goes to the top on their own. Everybody rises with the help of another. Oh God, cause those who you have ordained to help me to be restless until they locate me. In the name of Jesus. Pray that prayer with all your heart. Le paradisco tarama shanda, le grindo sapani atata, inte nemerende bradosa, la paragadose keteno. Oh God, my helper, oh et, hear the word of the Lord, continue to trouble my destiny helper as you did in the days of Esther. Give them sleepless nights until they favor me. Give them sleepless nights until they favor me. In the mighty name of Jesus, makana masha. In Tonama Shaga, Zipre, Zipre, Zipre. Oh, Ed, hear the word of the Lord. Oh, Ed, hear the word of the Lord. Continue to trouble my destiny helpers until they locate me. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Next prayer. We are still praying. Now, Psalm 114, verse, verse 4. It says, The mountains keep like rams and the hills like lambs. The mountains keep. The hill skipped. Why? Because God's children were coming. Now listen to me. We're going to be commanding the earth to swallow every mountain of resistance standing on our way. Are you set to pray? Say this next prayer with me. Say, Oh earth, hear the word of the Lord. Begin now to swallow and bury every mountain of resistance standing on my way. In the mighty name of God, praise the Lord, pray right now. Every invisible barrier, every mountain of resistance, every mountain of opposition, Oh 
earth hear the word of the Lord, begin to swallow them, begin to bury them, begin to swallow them, begin to bury them, begin to swallow them, begin to bury them. O earth, hear the word of the Lord. Every mountain of resistance, every mountain of opposition, begin to swallow them, begin to bury them, begin to swallow them, begin to bury them. The mountain of resistance in my career, swallow it or eat. The mountain of resistance in my business, swallow it or eat. The mountain of resistance in my marriage, swallow it or eat. Any area of my life that matters, that the devil is putting up mountains of resistance, oh eat. Hear the word of the Lord. Begin to swallow them. Begin to swallow them. Begin to swallow them. In the mighty name of Jesus, begin to swallow them. The mountains that are standing on my way between me and my destiny, the fulfillment of my destiny. Oh, it. Hear the word of the Lord. Swallow them. Bury them. Swallow them. Bury them. Swallow them. Bury them. Swallow them. Bury them. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Next prayer. Next prayer. Say this prayer with me. Say, O oh, earth, hear the word of the Lord. Force anyone holding my promotion to release it by force. Anyone holding my blessings. Anyone holding my pass to my next level. Force them to release it. Now, there's a reason why you need to pray this prayer. There are some people that their destiny is to make it in another nation. But every time they get to the embassy, the man or woman that is supposed to stamp accepted will always stamp denied. Many people who are supposed to shine in another nation, anytime they try to go to those nations, instead of them to get accepted, they get denied. There are people that there are jobs that will change their story. But when they get to the point, the one that will say, okay, you have been employed, the devil will enter them. They will just deny so there are people that the reason why they are where they are is because there are forces fighting them at the gates of their destiny. At the gates, at the gates. They get to the gates of their destiny, but the doors are shut before them. The doors are shut before them. Listen to me, I'm telling you from my own personal experience also. Listen to me, Satan waits for people at the gate to stop them from entering. So you're going to pray this prayer. Say, oh, earth, hear the word of the Lord. Any man or woman holding my blessing, cause them to release it by force. Cause them to release it by force. In the mighty name of Jesus. La krakata la krakatona. Zemente nemende roba. Ziklara la shaga. Eteno mama. Zerota tata. Zikota neto. Oh, et. Hear the word of the Lord. Hear the word of the Lord. Cause anyone holding my blessings to release it by force in the mighty name of Jesus. Bara, 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 lekeke, lekeke. Oh, it, hear the word of the Lord. Oh, it, hear the word of the Lord. Cause anyone holding my blessings, cause anyone holding my promotion, cause anyone holding my favor to release it by force in the mighty name of Jesus. To release it by force in the mighty name of Jesus. To release it by force in the mighty name of Jesus. They will not know peace until they release it. They will not know peace until they let me go. They will not know peace until they help me to, the, to get to the next level. Every one holding my blessings it will be too hot for them to hold it will be too hot for them to handle they will release it by force in the mighty name of jesus in the mighty name of jesus christ amen we're still praying ah yeah the bible said when korah datan and abiram stood up against moses you see that in numbers chapter 16 verse 30 32 number 16 32 the bible said the earth opened and swallowed them they came to stand against Moses. They gathered people to revolt, to end the life of Moses and destroy his work. They were human oppositions, standing between Moses and his vision. But what happened? The earth eliminated them. <laughs> Listen to me. The earth fights. The earth will fight for you right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Now I want us to pray this next prayer. Say, O oh, earth, hear the word of the Lord. Hear the word of the Lord. Remove anyone standing between me and my breakthrough. Pray that prayer right now. Anyone that have vowed that over their dead body will I break through on earth, bury them. Anyone that have vowed that I will not have peace on this earth, let them rest in peace. Oh, earth, remove 
anyone standing between me and my breakthrough in the mighty name of Jesus. Pray this prayer, child of God. The world we live in is full of wolves. Is full of wolves. Oh, it hear the word of the Lord. Remove anyone that stands between me and my breakthrough in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, it hear the word of the Lord. Remove anyone standing between me and my breakthrough in the mighty name of Jesus. Bakata, Lekota, Regrede, Zemeto, Panata, Zeneteno, Grandanateno, Naleko Shagala, Zigrondo Sipranate, Mentenenosa, Bracano Sakata. Oh, et. Hear the word of the Lord. Remove anyone that stands between me and my breakthrough, between me and my miracle job, between me and my visa, between me and my open doors, between me and my miracle marriage, between me and my peace. Anyone that stands that I will not go through, remove them. Anyone that says I will not move, remove. Anyone that says I will not move, remove. Anyone that says I will not move, remove. Anyone that says I will not move, remove them. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Next prayer. Matthew 16, from verse 18 to 19, Jesus said, Whatsoever you bind on it, <laughs> is bind in heaven. Whatsoever you lose on it, is lose in heaven. That means you have authority over the earth. You have authority. And that authority was given to you in Genesis chapter 1, verse 28. Man lost it and Jesus restored it back to man. Listen to me, you're going to be binding and losing right now. Are you set to pray this next prayer? Now, pray this prayer with me. Say, I bind on it every form of disappointment, delays, and setback in the mighty name of your prayer right now. I bind on it every form of disappointment, every form of delay, every form of setback. Begin to bind. Begin to bind delay. Begin to bind disappointment. Begin to bind disfavor. Begin to bind setback. Begin to bind stagnation. Begin to bind anything that is not of God. I bind every form of disappointment, delay, setback, backwardness, stagnation. I bind in the name of Jesus. Pray, 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 pray. Whatever is not of God, begin to bind them. Every form of disappointment, every form of delays, every form of setback, begin to bind them. Begin to bind backwardness. Begin to bind barrenness. Begin to bind sickness and disease. Begin to bind arrows of death. Begin to bind untimely death. Begin to bind failure. Begin to bind mediocre life. Begin to bind every witchcraft activity in your life. Begin to bind. Begin to bind whatever the Lord has not authorized in your life. Begin to bind them. As you bind them on earth, they are bind in heaven. As you bind them on earth, they are bind in heaven. Father, O oh earth, I bind, I bind every, on earth, every form of disappointment, every form of delays and setback. In the mighty name of Jesus, I bind on earth, every form of disappointment, every form of delay, every form of setback. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. It is done. It is done. As you are bind them on earth, so heaven has bind them on your behalf in the mighty name of jesus christ amen we are still praying now we're going to be losing we cannot bind without losing now i want you to pray this prayer say i lose on it all my blessings favors open doors and divine health in the mighty name of jesus pray that prayer right now i lose on it all my blessings favors open doors and divine health in the mighty name of God begin to lose begin to lose begin to lose begin to lose favor on it begin to lose favor in your life on it begin to lose breakthroughs over your life on it begin to lose uh, divine blessings begin to lose divine health in the mighty name of God begin to lose begin to lose all your hanging blessings begin to lose it in the name of Jesus I lose on it all my blessings I lose on it all my favor I lose on it divine health I lose on it open door 
doors. I lose on it. Breakthroughs begin to lose. Begin to lose. As you lose them on it, heaven is authorizing it. As you lose them on it, heaven is authorizing it. Whatever you desire, begin to lose it. I lose my miracle children. I lose my miracle job. I lose my favor. I lose my blessings. I lose divine health. I lose open heavens. Maripa katayada basoko pregedisha. Lemete neke brendo satona. Rabano kaganta. Tene metene ketena. Ribano kasia. I lose. I lose on earth everything that God has ordained for my life. I lose them for myself. I lose them right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Child of God, if this prayer is blessing you, I encourage you to like, subscribe, and also follow us on our Facebook page. As you do so, I say, God bless you in the mighty name of Jesus. Now lift up your hands to heaven and begin to appreciate the Lord. Begin to give Him thanks. Begin to give Him praise. Thank Him for the earth is in your favor. The earth is now working for you. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, we give you praise. Jesus, we adore you. Ancient of days, we magnify you. For in Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. Now, lift up the earth that you are holding. Lift it up. Lift it up right now. You're going to speak to that earth. Now, this is the instruction. Now, you're going to say to the earth, O earth, as I release you right now, go and do as you are commanded in the mighty name of Jesus. O earth, hear the word of the Lord. As I release you right now, go and do as you are commanded in the mighty name of Jesus. Now, after speaking this to the earth, go outside and pour the sand on the floor. Go and pour it on the floor. As you have done, as you do that, you will begin to see what you have said on earth manifest on earth in your life in the mighty name of Jesus. In case you don't have access to sand like this, you can use stone. Anything that represents the earth, you can use sand, you can use stone. And as you pray this prayer today, you will see the hand of God upon your life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. So I encourage you to join, to subscribe to this channel, follow us on Facebook, and also I encourage you to get our powerful prayer books on Amazon. The links to that book is in the chat of this video is a comment section is also in the description of this video you see the link to our amazon store we have powerful prayer books that will bless you also i want you to be part of our deliverance bible school we have a powerful school of deliverance that will teach you the art of spiritual warfare many of you are victims of the negative supernatural be part of that school enroll for that school and the lord will bless you richly in the mighty name of jesus christ my names still remain pastor Ekechi and i will see you in the next prayer meeting bye for now